Now the special case of Fermat-Nath theorem where n equals 4 has an elementary proof, and the proof is classic. It is the method of infinite descent. Now the statement is that there are no positive integer x, y, z such that x to the fourth plus y to the fourth equal z to the fourth. Now, however, we can prove an even stronger statement for this equation where z here is square. This is a stronger statement. We can prove that using the method of infinite descent. Now, the proof here is based on some property Pythagorean triples. Now, the key idea is that we assume there are solutions x, y, z. And among those solutions, let's choose the one with the smallest. This pair x, y, z with smallest z. We can assume x, y, z must be relative prime. Why? Because z is the smallest. If not, if there is common factor p, where p is a prime factor greater than 1, then if you plug in this into the equation, you're going to get this. You cancel p squared, then p is prime, and z here must be a multiple of p again, okay? which means new pair here, x divided by p, y divided by p, and z here is a factor of p squared, right? So this is another integer solution, but has a smaller z value, which is a contradiction. So if we find a smallest x, y, z, then we claim that there must be relative prime. Back to the important property of Pythagorean triple, where for the integer solution for this equation, now there is a well-established result that is ABC can be expressed in terms of M and N. You can refer to some online material for the proof of this basic results. Here, where M and N are relative prime, and they have an opposite parity, that is, one must be even, the other one must be odd, right? And of course, m is greater because we have m squared minus n squared here uh, for one of the values. We have x, y, z satisfy this equation. Of course, you know that x squared, y squared, and z would be a Pythagorean triple. We assume x is even, y is odd, and z squared is also odd, right? So that is Pythagorean triple here, x squared, y squared, and z, where m and n are relative prime, right? Now, when you rewrite this, in these three numbers, y, n, and m, are Pythagorean triples. Since y is odd number, right? And then n is even number, and m is odd number. In this case, we say there must exist, we call it, RNS this time, and so that the triple here is n must be an even number, 2RS, y would be this value and m, right? So that's again using the property of Pythagorean triples. All right, let's rewrite what we have so far. You know, the x, y, z was the triple of the original solution, m and n over 2 are relative prime, so the product is a perfect square which means the individual number is also a perfect square. That is, m is a perfect square, n over 2 is a perfect square. So Rns here is equal n over 2 with the integer. Since n over 2 is a perfect square, Rns are relative prime, same logic, r is a perfect square, and s is a perfect square. x0 is integer, square equal to r, y0 square equal to s, m equals this, of course, m equals r squared plus s squared. You plug in this equation here, what do we get? We get x0 to the first power, y0 to the first power, equal z lot to the second power. We have found another integer solution for this equation. However, z here is getting smaller, right? So original z is m squared plus n squared, right? Which is, of course, greater than m squared. And m squared here is greater than at, at z0. So in other words, we have found another new triple here, x0, y0, z0. And z0 is smaller, right? So which means this process 
of deriving a similar solution can be repeated indefinitely, contradicting our initial assumption that our original equation has no integer solutions. That's the method of infinite descent. We use this method and we rely on the property of Pythagorean triple. We show that there's no integer solution for this one. And of course, this is a stronger statement than the Fermat Lat theorem when n equal to 4. Right? There's no solution for x to the first power plus y to the fourth power equal z to the fourth power. All right? Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel.